Okay. Uh, hello everyone. Sinister Badger here. I just wanted to show, um, really quick what I've been working on. Let me look at the PNG file. So I'll start by opening Paint, and I will open this. And um, all right. So this is the picture I want to focus on here. I might actually make the other one, the others too. This is a skins for Minecraft. So, ah, let's get a little closer. There we go. It's like really look at those pixels. Okay. So we have um, pretty much everything in grand detail. Slide over a little bit so we well we could just look at the cape. Nice, nice. Beautiful. So let's start by looking at the face and what I've done. So we have we have a white skull here, and we have the two eyes. I couldn't do the nose because the way a, a Minecraft skin works, like noses are just very hard to do. So instead, I gave you a different mouth. But uh, all in all, everything does look pretty close. So that's why I keep calling it an upgrade, because essentially that's what it will be taken as. So let's uh, let's look straight up. I'm in a blank new world. Look over here. Click F5. So here we have the back, and that is the cape. The parts at the top are like what connects to the little red dots. That is what would connect to the back. And then the red to the bottom is where I tried make, to make it look like it was torn, but instead I gave it just a nice pattern to show like the cape stops there. He has leg pads all through the back, which is the leg pads seen here, but instead I just stretched them around a little bit. Um, his hands are the same as you can see. Uh, I didn't. I wasn't really given much to work with the hands. It was just red, so I just gave red hands. So let's go ahead and look at the front. So this is the front of the suit or the skin, and uh, that is the head. And you see, I have the white for the skull, and I just I gave more detail in the arm, like I patched it up with some pixels. Just so, um, just so it could look like it was kind of worn and tattered, even though it is a new suit. That's just the way I'm going to play it off as, because it, it, it just it goes with it, and I can't make everything perfect. But I did work very hard. Uh, this here is the red that we see above his belt, but I do have the waist, the little waist belt right there. That's what the uh, triangular pattern is, and I kept the red going all around it. And, um, the black on his top, that little gray part with the light, that is essentially what this is. But I left the, uh, light bar at the bottom for this. And then, uh, going up to the top, I did add in the, uh, I did add in... The shoulder blades, it just, it's not that noticeable. It's what's at the top of the skin. And, um, when he looks up, you see, uh, the pink, that, and the pink and the red that comes out the, uh, shoulders. Uh, that, oop, I keep opening the wrong thing. That is what this is essentially supposed to be. That is what it is. But it's just, like, upward, and you're not really going to notice. So it looks more like the head connects more to the actual body. But I mean, with Minecraft, you can only do it so much. And the only difference here is with the shoes, I couldn't really do the two white things at the time. So I played it off, giving him uh, two white things to the side instead of two white things to the top. And then uh, this is the fun part. I added an upgrade. So we're going to start with the jacket. Now, uh, the new ghost suit has a, uh, a vest. It now has a bullet vest for the accessory. That is what this is. And let me 
There we go. It is a, a bullet vest, and then on the back, I added a big green G on the cape. And remember, under you see under the G line, it's that pure red, and then it's that uh, light red. That's just where the cape cuts off because I couldn't give it that torn look like we see in the picture. I mean, I wish I could. I tried. I really, I wanted it to have that torn, bitten battle look, but I just, I couldn't. I, I tried. I, honest to God, I spit everywhere. I'm sorry. I tried. And then, um, going back here, the next accessory is, uh, the termination mode, which is, it's just an accessory, but am I... Getting in so deaf after working so long with this, I just felt like I could have some fun with it. So, if I turn the hat on, you see his eyes change. Uh, you see the white skull at the top, and then you see the the light gray bars go to the uh, the side of his eyes with black, and then two red eyes, and then the black on the face. And uh, essentially, for fun, and you could see like. I designed it to uh, connect with uh, kind of like um, wires connecting everywhere in a power source. But termination mode is just a cool little, it's just like a different accessory, you know, like he's out to go on a mission. He's out to go, he's just like some the enemy he was fighting ticked him off and he's ready to go out there and get a... Uh, lead his rebellion and fight and terminate the enemies. I mean, after designing the skin for so long, you know, I just decided to have fun with it and add some little story and character elements. And it still connects. You see the way I did the face? It connects down the little black things to the uh, chest that still hold everything together. But, um... See? On his head, he has uh, the, the little uh, connectors. So it's like all just like a giant uh, power source of wires that connect around this new mask. Um, but I mean, I know it's not 100% exact, but I did. I, honest to God, I tried my best. Um, I guess I'll leave this video open if people want to tell me how I did. You know, seeing if they want a tutorial on how to make a skin or something. How to sprite a skin, I don't mind. I'm figuring it out myself, but I am enjoying, like, here I've made a, a bunch of skins. And the, this one is a Ghost version 2.0. I'll actually show how it was done. Uh, right about there. So here is legs. His legs are here. These are his shoulders. This is the accessories. And then here's his cape. Here's his body. Here's the face and head. And here's the uh, termination side, and see on his head he has the um, little like solar panel, or I mean whatever you want it to be. I was just having fun with it at this point and designing, but uh, yeah, that is uh, the ghost skin. So uh, I hope you all enjoyed, and I hope to the friend who wanted this enjoys it. I'm about to post this now, and I I hope you like it. Please, comment, like, subscribe, tell me what you think. Tell me if you want more skins. I mean, I'll take in requests. Tell me what you think of the skin and if I did a good job making exceptions and keeping it relatively close, if not upgrading it a little more. Or if I should do the other ones. Thank you.